Shit. Oh my, why, where did I get that sword? Move right. Oh. I was moving the right stick. Oh my god. There's a lot of them. Oh my. Oh my god. Oh. Yeah, go away. Oh no, I got hit. Go away. Go away. Oh my god, Jesse, you crazy man. Hey, Petra. Oh. oh. Very nice. Oh, thanks. Hey, Jesse, check this out. And three, two, one, pop. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty cool, right? You can try it too Duck! if you. My God, Axel. Dude, you're getting pretty good at this. I've always been good. You guys are working way too hard. Yeah, we're getting the job done. You're always looking to one up us, aren't you? Go away. Yeah, yeah, that's the way to be. That is one seriously cool temple. Yeah, points for Ivor, I guess. This was a good tip. Well, Jesse? So, Let's find some treasure. Are we doing this? Order of the stone? Let's get some treasure. Treasure! Hmm. So much for treasure. This cupboard is bare. Come on, you know how these places work. The treasure's never just out in the open. Let's fan out and search the place. Alright. Now there's lava. That's... These what? channels of lava are blocked by sticky pistons. If I were to unblock them... Hmm. It would be a bad idea. These channels lead to the center of the room. They look like they're designed to let lava flow from those channels in the wall. Why okay, would you maybe it isn't. That? Maybe it isn't a bad idea. <laughs> okay, and let's go to the other side. I have to go this way. All right, great. Let's talk to Petra. There's three of them, I think, actually. Hi, Petra. This place is cool. Knew you'd find it. Um. So, how are you feeling lately? Wither sickness free, I think. Now I'm just trying to get used to having teammates and people who worry about me. That's pretty new for me. It's nice though. What do you think Ivor knew about this place? Eh, who knows? That guy's read like a million books and traveled all over the world. You probably start to learn a thing or two about a thing or two. Thoughts on this place? I think I'd rather be in a straight fight than doing all this switch-pulling stuff. But I'm glad Ivor's intel about this place was good. Okay, I'm gonna keep trying to solve this. Jesse, it ain't that hard. Oh. I retracted what I just said. Hey, Olivia. Yeah? Any ideas for how to fix this? Well... These channels of lava are blocked in strategic locations by those sticky pistons. Unblock them, and I'm guessing something cool will happen. So, have you been having a good time hunting for treasure? If you had asked me a couple of months ago, I would never have thought I would like all this adventuring and treasure hunting stuff. But this has actually been a really good time, and I've been getting lots of great stuff to build with. So what kind of treasure do you hope we find in here? Well, I've been working on a build that could use another couple dispensers, but some cocoa beans would be cool too. Okay, I'm gonna figure this out. Cocoa Never beans? You for a minute. I've always doubted it. Alright, let's talk to Axel and pull that hey, switch. Axel? What you need? And buddy? try to figure it out. 
Axel, what do you think of the situation? Um, I don't know about the situation. I kind of do more blowing stuff up. So, if you need someone to do stuff like that, I'm totally your guy. Right. So, what kind of loot you think we're gonna find in here? Oh man, well, I want to make a room with an emerald floor, right? Well, who doesn't? I'm like four emeralds away, so getting some emeralds would be pretty sweet. Man, we have the best adventures, don't we? Yeah, it's pretty sweet. I was worried I wouldn't be cool enough or smart enough or whatever enough to be in the Order of the Stone. Thanks for always believing in me, buddy. You know it. Okay, I'm gonna keep working on this. Sounds good, dude. Alright. I think I might have a decent guess on how to do this. It's gonna close the other one. Again. I think it's just pull on its own. Huh. Let me just pull this. No, it's not. Oh, I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. We do this one first. All right. Then we do. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. We go over here, and then we pull this lever. And then we do the third one. Hmm. Right. Let's just try a few different things then. Let's go ahead and pull this. Okay, it's gonna block the other one. I'm gonna go back over here. Now we do this one? Over here? That's all I can assume. Aha! Ha ha! <laughs> I'm a genius. I think I actually would have been disappointed if the floor didn't open up into a dark, creepy passageway. This kind of reminds me of when we first found the Order's Temple. We were such a scared bunch of noobs back then. Hey, I wasn't scared. No. Then who was it that was yelling? Wow, yeah, that feels like it was, I don't know, a million years ago. We've packed a lot in since then. And to think, that was just the beginning. Yeah, and that was before we'd fought wither storms, hung out with Enderman, reunited the Order. So crazy. Some chests. All right, let's see what we've got. It's not that simple. Uh, there's no way it's that simple. It's dark down here. There's gonna be mobs. One hundred percent. Hey, it's a cake. Ah oh, man, you got cake? It's just, I really love cake. My mouth is practically watering just looking at it. Hey, if you want it, it's all you. Oh man! Oh man! Oh man! Thank you! Huh! A pumpkin? Not bad. I suppose that could be useful if we run into Enderman. And let's uh -huh. see, we've got one more thing in here. It's. What? what Enchanted flint and steel. What are you talking about? Whoa! That's super cool. I've never seen flint and steel like that before. That glow, is it some sort of enchantment? I don't know. I've seen people put an unbreaking enchantment on flint and steel before, but that's not unbreaking. You could give it a shot and find out. Okay, flint and steel, do your thing. If it blows up, it's not my fault. Well, I have definitely oh. never seen flint and steel do that before. Uh -huh. I was right. <laughs>
looks like some monsters have a death wish. So what's the plan? Yes, me. It seems like a good time for a secret handshake. Yeah, so the warrior whip. The don't wrap. Obviously. Warrior whip, go. Come on, Jesse. Make it. Yeah. Just... There we go. Don't toss her in the lava. You guys, that was amazing. Okay, Damn right. Okay. It wasn't bad. Axel. I gave you cake. Stop complaining. Stop being all. Alright, let's just whoop their ass. Let's whoop their ass. Go away. Go away. <laughs> Dead. Oh my. Oh. Is it filling up? Vines. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, let's get out of here. Yeah, let's go. Uh oh. Cave uh -oh. spiders. Why did it have to be cave spiders? The only way out of here is through them, so get ready. Go away. I don't need you. Don't need you in my life. The tunnel is closing. That's a strong sword. That was amazing. Why is no one freaking out? We got on the inside, Axel. We gotta move. Yeah. And she's closing on someone's legs. Like my lucky sword. Oh no! Come on, mash, 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 mash. Okay, well, I squished someone or something. Come on, dude. Let's get you out of here. I tell you guys, doing that never gets old. Woo! Yeah, not too bad. Killing a bunch of monsters, getting sweet treasure. Like that flint and steel thing? You gotta try it again. I'd be curious to see it again too. I'm dying to know how it works. Hmm. Way ahead of you on that one, Axel. Come on, let's burn the tree stump. Whoa, whoa. Well, well. Where'd you get the new toy? <laughs> Looks a little, uh, sophisticated for you, Jesse. Order of the losers. Yeah, losers. Ugh, who let you guys out of your cave? Joke's on you. We don't Aiden and the Pussycats. Well, well, well. If it isn't Aiden and the Pussycats. That's not our name. So what are you, Ocelot, doing here anyway? The Ocelots were Lucas's gang. We ditched that name just like we ditched him. Yeah, we rebranded. We're the Blaze Rods now. Ugh. Dumb name. Wow, you guys are terrible at naming. That's a dumb name. <laughs> Says the heroes that just called their group the New Order of the Stone. And where's Lucas, huh? The minute the Order decided you were cool... For whatever reason... He wouldn't stop sniffing around you like a tame dog. You take that back! Mm, no. Hey! Lucas is ten times the guy you are. Yeah, Lucas is a hero, which is more than I can say for any of you creeps. You probably think that thing makes you so special. Classic Jesse. You take all the best stuff and never give anyone else a chance. That should have been ours. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Blaze Rods. <laughs> shame in being second-rate aid. Blaze Rods. Everyone can do what the Order of the Stone can. <laughs> well, that's, that's just what I expect from someone as small-minded as you, Jesse. Hand over the flint and steel, Jesse. Don't make me ask again. I'll you fight. Get that one. It's supposed to be mine. <gasps> Some hero you are, Jesse. <sighs> Fine. Mine. What hope do we have when heroes like you are throwing your weight around like this? It's not always going to be this way, though. Come on, you guys. Let's get out of here. 
Blaze Rod! Blaze Rod! Look out, Jesse! You look out. I don't out. remember him being that angry Aiden. before. Hmm. Wow. Us being the new order of the stone is really getting to that guy. He's gone crazy. We should be careful. He seems different, scarier. Man, and all because he wanted that flint and steel. What are you gonna do with it? Ivor's the one that told us about this temple. He might know something about it. Hopefully, Ivor can tell us more about it. Okay. So we're going to see more of Aiden in this episode, more than likely. I, th I think he just doesn't like being second. Finally starting to recognize stuff again. Whenever he's first, he good, tries to belittle people. Cheers Whenever to he's second, he tries to belittle people. So. I Aiden was saying about us back there. We do get a lot of treasure. And I guess sometimes we might throw our weight around. What? No. Aiden's got a bad case of treasure envy, pure and simple. Come on, Aiden's just jealous, isn't that obvious? He sees us with our fancy armor, cool treasure, and he wishes he had it too. I guess so. Ruben. Well, no matter what Aiden thinks, there's one thing I know. What's that? Food? Hey, think we're awesome. They're back. No, they're no, no, back. no. I was, I was joking. Run! <laughs> Full of monsters, hidden temples, treasure. Oh, I can't take it anymore. Oh, my God. Welcome back. High five. I wonder if you can just leave her hanging. High five me. Me. It actually hurt a little bit. Oh. Oh, my God. What? It wasn't a happy to see us scream. Wow, that's new. It somehow manages to evoke skulls and tentacles. Oh, that thing looks completely dangerous. Eh, not my fault. Look out! Oh, uh, help! <laughs> what? Oh, stop your whining. What are your pathetic injuries in comparison to my majestic tower? Ivor? <sighs> of course. Oh, Jesse, you're back! Don't listen to a word these fools tell you. It's a fire hazard. And your face is an ugly hazard. So what's this Damn. structure? It's my new house. And also, uh, my gift to the community. If anyone's short on lava, this is the place to get more. <laughs> You're welcome. Jesse, all I wanted was what any man wants. A little house of my own. With loads of lava pouring off it. Ivor, I know you mean well, but your house wants to kill people. Dude, you made a killer house. Exactly. Killer. What about just moving it someplace else? I'm sure... Move it? Way more lava is going to spill out if we do that. Well, we have to tear it down. We can't let that monstrosity stand. <laughs> It's my house, Jesse. I have just as much a right to build something as all these people, don't I? He does, but I've got vision. Well, they've got, they've got community planning. What I'm sorry, Ivor. Sorry, Ivor, but your house is way too much of a hazard to the community. Tear it down, everyone. Good call. <laughs> Axel. Slippery slope, Jesse. Today, the lava house. Tomorrow. Who knows what kind of rules you'll be imposing? Don't be a sore loser, Ivor. Fat. <laughs> Haven't seen you around in a while. So what can I do for you? Ivor, we found something in that temple you told us about. What? You did? <laughs> yes. Great to see you again. Let's do lunch. I'll bring the carrots. There's no telling who's listening. Meet me in the treasure room. Ten minutes. 
and bring the thing you found. Oh my god. Well, if we're gonna tear this down, we better start getting some buckets together to scoop up all the lava. You got any iron? Oh man, no. I'm all out. Do I have iron? Okay, we better go mine some more. Nope. We'll catch up with you later. Yeah, once we give this majestic house the funeral it deserves. Stay out of trouble, you two. <laughs> you stay out of trouble. Good one. Thanks. Later, guys. Come on, let's go find <laughs> Ivor. Wow, this place is really shaping up. There's Lucas. Whoa! Lucas! I don't believe it! Oh, hey guys! You have some pretty cool stuff in here. Hey, Lucas! Great to see you! It's been a while. I really missed you guys. We missed you too. We have so many other treasures. Boy, you've sure been busy. Oh, wow. You framed it. I'm him ish <laughs> yeah how are you doing there's a fucking pork job just hanging off the wall <laughs> i'm sorry i really really miss him every morning i wake up and just for a minute i can pretend that he's just in another room or rooting around outside looking for carrots and then Every morning, I get to remember all over that he's gone. I'm so sorry. <sighs> okay, guys. I promise I wasn't just here to bum everybody out. I actually came back because I need to tell you something. It's about this weird run-in I had with Aiden. Oh, I hate that guy. Uh-huh, yeah, we saw him too. The Order of the Stone and the Blaze Rods are just as friendly as ever. That's an understatement. He's just been so jealous of you and the rest of the Order ever since you saved the world from the Witherstorm. He's convinced that he was supposed to be a hero. Ever since he took over the Ocelot and the Blaze Rods, it just seems like he's gotten meaner. He's pushing Maya and Gil around. Aiden's a stupid bully. He doesn't scare me. Yeah, that's what I used to say too. But he's been freaking me out lately. He got super aggressive. He demanded to know what treasure you were after next. So what'd you find that got Aiden so excited anyway? Check it out. Wow. What a weird glow. Yeah, I know. I'm supposed to show it to... You found it! Yeah! Whoa! Dude, what's wrong with you? This is the greatest find of our time. I can't believe you're actually... I mean, it's got some sort of enchantment on it, but it's just a flint and steel, right? Jesse. That's not just some sort of enchantment. That glow, that enchantment, is the work of a very old group of builders. A group so old that they existed even before the Order of the Stone. Whoa. Yeah. Dramatic. Wow, so that temple we went to, was that built by these old builders? That's my suspicion. But it's what's inside the temple that interests me even more. You see, if these builders truly existed, and if you found their temple, that means we're one step closer to finding the Ever Source. What a beautiful sight. Looks like you came back just in time, Lucas. Wow. So is this Ever Source thing valuable? Valuable doesn't even tell the half of it, Jesse. Okay. Interesting. I'm interested. The Ever Source is said to be an object of incredible power possessed by the old builders. It was some sort of treasure or artifact that gave them an endless supply of precious materials. Think about it, Jesse. That temple must have been its hiding place. Wow. Old builders? You learn something new every day. Okay, so this flint and steel might have this old builder enchantment, but how do you know that's where this Eversource thing is? I've traveled near and far, Jesse. And that temple, that flint and steel, is the only firm proof that I've ever seen of the old builders. That does seem like a pretty good bet. Old builders, ever sources, ancient mysteries. You know I'm in. Excellent! I'll pack my adventuring things immediately. Wait. All right, he's coming with us. Okay. Coming? Wow, sounds like you guys have a lot to get to. I, uh, guess I'll take off. Nope. 
You're coming with. Yep. I need a buffer between me and Ivor. Let's get moving. Aiden's gonna be there at some point. <laughs> Adventure! Lucas, I know it's daytime, but watch our backs, okay? I can't believe we're bringing Ivor with us. I mean, it's nice that he's so excited, but oh, not my he's knowledgeable. Ever adventuring companion. Hey, you can't argue that when it comes to all this ancient history and treasure, Ivor knows a lot. Sure, that's true. These trees are enormous. I love it so much. He just really gets on my nerves sometimes. Understandable. Remarkable. Look at this architecture. So old. So exquisite. Oh, this is just how I dreamed it would be. So, you think it's the right place then? Oh, yes, Jesse. Oh, yes, I very much do. Wow, it looks so different during the day. Okay, but careful what you touch. There could be traps everywhere. Petra! Long guy. We Are were just here. I am? I'm not sure that's possible. Huh. Doesn't look like those lava channels work anymore. Right. What happens if we were to pull the lever? Nothing. Okay, let's talk to Petra. I can't believe we missed some sort of secret area here last night. Uh, we were kind of fighting. Oh, a ton of monsters. It's not surprising that we didn't hit every single nook and cranny. That is true. That is very true. Wait. Let's pull... Okay, we can't pull that. You look excited, Ivor. Excited? I'm ecstatic. Thrilled! Overjoyed! The Eversource could finally be within my grasp! And use for good? Once, uh... Once we find it, that is. And Lucas. Pretty cool temple, right? Yeah, it's amazing. Not gonna lie to you, Jesse. I'm pretty excited to be along for the ride on this one. Um, can we jump down? No. Can I use it? Okay, what am I doing? Hmm. Oh my god. Barely got out of there last night. Doesn't look like it's opening up again anytime soon. That's all right. I had enough of the spiders and lava and everything that had to offer already. Oh, oh. Well, that wasn't there last night. All right, let's climb it. That looks promising. I'm heading up. Fantastic! We'll follow right behind you! Uh, yeah. What he said. I believe it. So you think this Eversource thing is up here? I highly doubt it. Hard Ooh, to pressure say, plate. Jesse. As the story goes, the old builders feared its potential. So they hid it away in a place where it would never be found. And ha! It never has been! Fair play, room. What is Jesse doing up there? Why did the Ocelots have a growl? Well, that seems promising. No, I don't. But we'll do it anyways. Jesse! What do you see? <gasps> it's some kind of portal? Ah, uh, spectacular! But where does it lead? I don't know. Flint and steel this portal. It's not like anything I've ever seen. Has to be. Here goes nothing. Right, light it. <laughs> Holy fuck! Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, thanks for bringing this back to me, Jesse. Why are you here? I knew you were good for something. You're gonna regret that, Aiden. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah? 
Shut up, Gil! Step aside, Jesse. We're heading through that portal now. Oh, no way! Aiden, you're done. This is where it ends. Fine. Blaze rods! Clear me a path. Ooh. You ain't doing nothing. Not to me. You know that? I win these. Oh my god. Let's go! We've got to follow them. If they get the Eversource, who knows what trouble they'll cause. Yes. We're going after Aiden and we're going to take I didn't even see down. the third option. It's something about Axel. Go. Where are we? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh? Don't worry, I've got you. Oh my god. Oh, you are surprisingly heavy. I am huh? the proportionate weight for my height. Thank you very much. There you go. <laughs> Easy now. Yes, thank you, thank you. Okay, what just happened? How did that portal even work? I suppose much the same way a portal to the nether works, except to an entirely different world. Hmm. Oh my god. Hey, uh, you guys see that? What? I'm starting to think Ivor was right about this being another portal. I'm liking you better by the minute, Louie. Wow. Looks like some kind of city. That's incredible. That's it. That's where it must be, the Eversource. A city in the clouds. It almost sounds impossible. I just don't know how we're going to reach it. Yeah, that's definitely going to be a problem. I can't believe this. We fall through a portal into another world, and then we can't even go anywhere. Okay, people, you know the drill. What did you guys bring with you? That's my private business. <laughs> Didn't exactly bring a whole lot. Why? Because we're building a bridge, and it'll take everything we have. I don't know. Seems like a long way. Do we have Break the cars? island. I mean, it's really, really far. Yes, very astute. Elementary, my dear Lucas, the underside of this island is much, much bigger than it appears. Really? Jesse's right. If we strip this whole island down to nothing, it might just be enough. Damn right. Yeah. Stop pushing! I'm not pushing! Lucas is pushing! I'm just trying to keep away from the edge! It's all edge! <laughs> Okay, gang, I think that should do it. Let's make ourselves a bridge. Excellent! Let's go! Why are you... Why, okay, was... <laughs> Why did Ivor do that? Everybody off. Ivor. Seriously? <laughs> this is in memory of my lava house. Long live lava! You're building. I... You... I... I, I don't... Hey, yeah, we're... Building is something wrong with that? I uh, uh you don't know? Y you 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 were building. Uh, unauthorized building is against the law. Wait, there's a law saying people can't build? Yes, it's forbidden. This this makes no sense. No sense. Okay, I'll bite. Why is building against the law? Oh, uh, it, this is making me terribly nervous. But uh, first, those other outsiders. Now you, other outsiders. Where are uh, they? Uh, uh, they went to the inn. I I'm sorry, but that's all I know. Wait, wait, wait. Come I'm back. Super busy, sorry. And he's gone. <sighs> Darn. I wonder if everyone here is that... nervous. Whoa. Wow. Incredible. Wow. Yeah. Absolutely beautiful. Yes. Damn right. Clearly the Eversource is capable of miraculous things. And when I get my hands on it. Hey, how about you take a massive chill pill and we find it first? Yes, 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 yes. I'm just getting excited. And as crazy as Aiden's been lately, if he gets that thing, 
It would be bad. Well, if we beat him to it, he won't be able to get his slimy little hands on the thing. We need to find Aiden. He's got our flint and steel, and he's up to no good, but we're gonna stop him. He mentioned an inn, right? That seems like our best lead for finding Aiden so far. Agreed. The blaze rods already have a head start, so we need to get moving. We don't have any time to lose. Hmm. I don't need some to end is up there. <laughs> no, I just, you know, I'm not allowed. All right. Let's have a look at this. Boy, these are some popular crafting tables. Don't worry, everyone. Your turn will come in time. Please have your materials ready when you approach the crafting table. Huh? I knew I shouldn't have waited so long to eat. <laughs> this is a long line just to use a crafting table. You're telling me I'm so hungry I could practically eat my wheat right here, but I won't. I'll be patient and turn it into delicious bread instead. What uh what can I do for you? I'm so hungry. It seems pretty inefficient to have everyone sharing one crafting table. Why don't you just build your own? What? Hey, I don't know what your deal is, but I don't want any part of it. Please leave me alone now. Thank you. What? Hi. I told you. No building for me. Thank you. Okay. That's his problem. Hmm. Hey there. Are you on the schedule for the furnace this afternoon? I didn't think there were any more appointments today. Hang on. Let me see here. Dale, ten stone blocks. Oh yes, that went very well. Uh, no appointment for me, thanks. I'm actually looking for the inn. Milo's place, right? It's back there. Okay, okay. Right, Milo, thanks. Yeah, we all know Milo. We all know him. No building, no crafting, no brewing, no forging. Unless with express permission from the founder. All complaints must be registered in person. That's it. You can stop writing now. <laughs> Tense. <laughs> it's fucking stupid. Hey, Petra, what you looking at? Just admiring the sights, actually. This place is so cool. I'm not usually one for, like, checking out people's builds or whatever, but even I have to admit, this is really impressive. The founder isn't accepting visitors right now. Okay. What's going on here? Captain Reginald, at your service. Hey, so what are you guys up to? Ah, oh, just supervising this citizen while she does her build. The founder finally approved my petition. The founder? That's her palace up there. She is the keeper of the Eversource. Why would you tell us that? She builds everything you see. Some days I can't even fathom how she keeps it all straight. She builds everything? Yeah, well, it sure is amazing. <laughs> That's why she gets to make the calls about what does or doesn't get built. Like my build. It's no easy feat to get all these oak blocks. Your petition was very well handled. I just don't understand why everyone shouldn't be allowed to build. Ha! <laughs> what a sentiment. I mean, it is a good thought, but it's crazy. Hmm. Hi. Uh, hello. Wow, you are really focused, huh? I mean, yeah. It took me weeks to get this building permit, and I am not going to waste it. So is our breaking lot blocks limit. Come here. Oh, whoop your in what not let's talk to Lucas. How's it going, Lucas? I'm okay. Just watching these guards. They really mean business. Yeah, I wouldn't mess with them if I were you. Okay, I think the inn is up this direction. So... I can't believe they just built their way right into town. I know, I've never seen anything uh, like it. hello. Oh, oh my, hello again. Can we, uh, do anything for you? Were you two talking about me just now? Um, no, no, uh, of course not. Uh-huh. Please don't hurt us. Can you two point me in the I know, just, you know. They must be looking for Milo. 
Shh. Uh, I mean, no, no, no. We don't know any Milo. Really? Because it sure sounds like you know him. Uh, okay, okay. We know of him. If you really want to find him... He's the kind of messy-looking guy. Spender's always falling down. So messy. Thanks, I guess. You guys seem like you might have the scoop. What's up with the Eversource? Well, um, mm, well, it's, it's in the palace. I'll just leave you guys alone then. Have a nice day. Please stop building. It scares me. What? <laughs> Nothing. We could have almost died just. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't no fucking way, bro. All right, let's go this way. Uh, Milo, okay. Let's talk to the guard. I just want to do most things before talking to Milo. Sorry, stranger. Can't come up here. Why not? Alright then. Good talk. Good talk. Can I go down here? No. Okay, let's talk to Milo. All signs point to that being the innkeeper. Like that sign. <laughs> okay. And where should I put them? Yes, just get them here. I'll deal with them. Get out of here. Go, go. Uh, why, hello there. What can I do for you? I'm not sure what the custom is where you come from, but uh, here <laughs> it is considered impolite to stare. Uh, hi, I'm sorry to bother you. Are you Milo? Yes, yes, that's me. Just make sure. A pleasure to meet you. Uh, don't see many new arrivals here in Sky City. Now, what can I do for you, friend? I'm busy, but I can spare a moment for a friendly stranger. I heard you talk to the blaze rods earlier. What did they want? Hmm. Hmm. Blaze rods. Hmm. I... I don't know any blaze rods. You must have been misled. I'm sorry, but it's like I told those other outsiders. I can't help you. Uh. Now, please. Hey, is this our guy? He tell you where to find the blaze rods? How many of you are there? I told you, I don't know anything. There's a lot of us. Anything yet? Is he hiding them somewhere? Look, I know you talk to them, Milo. Just spill it. Fine. If it will make you leave me alone, that Aiden fellow did come talk to me earlier. Wanted to know where the Eversource was. Called it! I just told him what everyone else already knows. The Eversource is in the palace with the founder. That's all that happened, I swear. What a bunch of creeps. Yes, I wasn't terribly fond of them. Yeah, me so neither now. Where is Aiden now? The group left for the palace, and I haven't seen them since. Attention! Attention, everyone! Just a moment of your time, please. Emergency meeting attendance is mandatory. Oh, hell no. Oh, slime blocks. Curious. Someone's gonna make it. Someone's gonna make the about. joke. Someone within the next... Oh, I don't know. It's the founder. Someone in the future... Even in the chat might make a joke. You little I bastard. What this is all about. Yes, I'm nervous being surrounded by so many people. Guys, I think I found the blaze rods. Oh no. What are they doing? People of Sky City, I'm sorry to pull you from your duties, but something urgent has come to my attention. A crime has been committed. A crime? What kind please, of crime? Please, please remain calm. Earlier today, outsiders built a bridge into our fair city from a distant island. Now, whether these outsiders know it or not, this is a violation of Sky City's most sacred law. No unauthorized building. Wait, is that you? Are you the bridge builders? Uh... Everyone, everyone. Yeah, that one. I didn't know it was against the law. It was just a bridge. This is nuts. Jesse, wherever you are, step forward now. I have already been informed of your identity. I appreciate that you may be ignorant of our laws, but I will warn you, Sky City is small, and I promise that if you try to hide, I will find you. We need to get to that ever source at whatever cost. This is clearly our fastest way into the castle. By getting arrested? Wait! Don't be fooled by the Founder's lies. I can help you come up with a plan to get into the palace. Here I am! I trust him. I built the bridge! Are you crazy? Does she look like she's... Go with Milo, fuck you. I'm going with Milo. Me 
too. Whitman, follow me. Wait, wait, hey, I'm coming hey, peacefully. That's them. They're getting away. After them. Jesse, run. Get up, run. Why wait? Come on. Fuck you. We ain't catching me. Jesus. These guards are something. <laughs> Just in here, yes. There's nowhere to hide in here. It's a dead end. Before I take you to any further. You must take an oath. I of course. They went this way. You must swear to never reveal what I'm about to show you. What? Okay. Do you swear that? You can't let him get away. Milo, I solemnly swear that I will never tell your secret to anyone else. Fantastic. All right. Philippe? Come on, Philippe. Right this way. <laughs> this is Build Club. Whoa. Wow. Everything you see before you was built from resources that my people have saved or uh, obtained. Do they have a sponge? Man, can't be easy to come by some of this stuff. Nice work. Wow, this is quite the secret hideout, Milo. Very nice. <clears throat> it is not a hideout. It is a build club. You see, one day a long time ago, I was just a citizen of Sky City, like any other. I wanted to make a community garden, so I put in a petition for a dirt block, and mercy me, it was granted. But in my excitement and haste to build my garden, I accidentally dropped my new block, and it fell right over the edge. For my crime, I was tossed into the Founder's Dungeons, and I was in there for a very, very long time. Wait, you just dropped some dirt. What was the crime? The crime, Jesse, was the egregious wasting of resources. You see, in our world, when something falls over the edge, it is gone forever. But I have always believed in my heart that just because building is risky, it doesn't mean that no one should do it. If only I had known you were builders sooner, I would have helped you all escape when I first met you, rather than let your friends be taken. But at least you are here, yes? I would like to save Lucas. You said something before about having a plan? A different way into the palace to save our friends? Yes, I did say that. Hey, Milo! Ah, hello, my friends. Bringing in outsiders? Seriously? Pretty hard to keep this a secret club if you just bring people in. Yeah, we have it hard enough as it is. Everyone, please! Guys, don't worry. We're builders just like you. Yeah, Jesse's right. Just chill out. We're the ones that built that bridge into town today. Dude! What? Milo! Jeez! Milo! Are you kidding me? The most wanted criminals in the whole city? We gotta turn them in before the guards break our door down. Well, no. Let's not do that. I assure you, harboring them is worth the risk. They are the epitome of Build Club material. Builders, I'm not sure. They say they're builders. Oh, perhaps a challenge? All right, then. If Milo says you're these amazing builders, prove it. All right. Yeah, build something. Now, see here. This is all highly disrespectful to my guests. I'm the leader here. I think I know my way around a crafting table better than any of you chumps. Oh, cocky. Let's see if you can back that up. We don't know many recipes, so if you just show us something that they build where you come from. You're going to be just fine, Jesse. Jesse, it took us many weeks to scrape together this inventory. Please, use them for your build. Oh, Is it thanks. an anvil? Or an iron golem? Let's see what we've got to work with. I... If... Yeah. Anyone got something to take notes with? No. Let's make an anvil. Darn. I guess I'll just have to try to remember all this then. Eh? Getting nervous All right. <laughs> what? No, of course. There we go. All this day is going ag Boom! Check that out. <laughs> I've seen one of those before. 
Yes, but we've never been able to figure out how to make one ourselves. Very impressive. Oh, it's called an wait anvil. a minute. This is called an anvil. It's very useful and impressive. I can understand why the guards are after you. I mean, that was awesome. Right? I told you. Yeah, we're really sorry. Wowzers. So sorry. <sighs> yeah. Sorry. We're sorry. Hey, these things happen. Apologies totally accepted, dudes. Now, uh, how about that whole getting us into the palace thing? Yeah, that would be great. Ah, yes, of course, of course. That is, after all, why you are here. I must say, though, after seeing you in action, your skills are even more impressive than I could have imagined. So impressive that I wonder if I could implore you for a tiny favor. What kind of favor? I help you get into the palace. You help me steal the Eversource for my people. Oh, no. Unlimited resources for everyone! I'm overwhelmed at the thought. Okay, but my friends are in trouble in there. So for breaking into the palace, we're going to save them. This is an acceptable and noble arrangement. Good. Now, as for how to get into the palace, according to my informants, the founder keeps the Eversource behind a secret door located in her throne room. Dramatic. Every night, the founder leaves guards at every door. But there's a single window at the back of the palace that is left unguarded. It's an almost perfect point of entry. But it is far too high. <laughs> if we can find a way through that window, the Eversource would be practically within our grasp. Okay, so we'll just climb up. That doesn't seem too hard. You have not seen this wall. We have tried, but it is sheer steel blocks. No handholds. Means you guys need to start thinking like builders out there. We're gonna make a ladder. Building ladders? Craft a way in? If you could show us how to craft something that would reach the window, we could get this heist underway. All right. Yeah, they probably want me to make a ladder. Yep. All right. Let's make a ladder. So put three more sticks down here and bang, ladder. Jesse, we will never forget this day. Okay, How big is this wall now? This should take us right into the throne room. Once inside, we will just need to find the secret entrance that it's the not that big. supposedly uses. Isn't it exciting? On our way to changing everything! Hey, would you keep it down, Milo? We're sneaking in, remember? Sneaking. Right, right, right. My apologies. I'm just so excited. Actually, out in the field, applying ladders to a wall. All right. Look at that. saying things to me that I already Whoa! Oh. Jesse! Jesse! Petra! Boy, am I glad to see you guys. Right back at ya. So glad you two are okay. What happened to you? We were in the dungeon, but we broke out. It's a good thing you guys are here. Aiden's going after the Eversource. Which we obviously can't abide. We're here to get it first. Fantastic. That is what we are doing as well. Who, uh, who's this guy, by the way? I mean, I assume he's cool, right? Oh, right. Milo, Lucas. Lucas, Milo. Milo, Ivor, Ivor, Milo. He's a new friend. I am charmed. Yeah, yeah. The Founder's secret entrance is supposed to be somewhere in this throne room. If it's in here, we'll find it. Okay. So it's either here or over here. Okay, it's in there. <laughs> I'm getting a very door vibe from this. Yeah. What happened to it? 
Just need to make something to activate that redstone circuit again. There's got to be something in here we can use. Like a lever. If you can find one of those bad boys, we'll have that secret door open in a snap. Maybe even a minecart. Let's have a look over here. Habits of the Enderman by Soren? Well, how'd that get here? Huh. Wow, it's so big. Nothingness, I mean. Is that not just above the ground? Like, that's all I can only imagine. So, how was prison life? Oh, it was wonderful. I've always wanted time behind bars to work on my poetry. That was sarcasm, in case you were curious. Figured that one out. Um, Petra. Let's talk to Petra. See anyone? Oh. Not yet, but the acoustics are funky in this place, so it's hard to tell when people are coming. We shouldn't hang around. Got it. Um, where's Lucas there? How's it looking? Still looking like it needs power. Don't worry, I'll find the answer. Okay, I believe in you. That's a homie right there. Where is... Okay, there's a crafting table. There he is, there's Milo. Can you believe it? We got in. Yes, I'm very grateful to you for all of your help. Give yourself some credit, Milo. You've done Build Club proud. Tree. Hmm. I get the feeling this is a special tree. Let's yes, break it. The ground you're standing on is actually the original island that all of Sky City started from. That tree dropped the saplings that grew into every tree on the island. I may not agree with the founder's methods, but even I must admit, that's an impressive feat. It truly that is. It is pretty special. Oh, a cobblestone generator. Huh. <gasps> a cobblestone generator. Amazing. Lava and water. Placed exactly we can get cobblestone and, and we can break the tree for create sticks. Cobblestone. Genius. I want it. That is ingenious. It truly is. So now give me the the tree. Hmm. Oh, dead bush, okay. That'll give more me a stick. Bush. Barely more than a bundle of sticks. Bunch. Hopefully no one will miss one dead bush. Perfect. I think okay. that should be everything I need to make a lever now. Yeah. Okay, let's do this. It is. What happens if I was just to put it here? Out of curiosity. Huh. Ah, my old friend the lever. Fantastic! Yeah. Didn't know you were watching. My apologies. It is still just such a thrill to see someone so confident and sure in their building abilities. Okay, let's let's let oh my god, whoa, what happened to that? Camera angle fucked up the 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 the, the thing. Right now? I, how I moved. Probably something like Jesse. It looks like it doesn't have any power. <laughs> what? <laughs> Jesse, you good? A mine cars. Eversource, here we come. Just enough for all of us. <gasps> wow, look at all these chests. Yeah, and they're all people? Ocelots! Creeper, zombie, sheep, pigman. Curious. But what does it mean? 
Wool. Huh. Ah, eggs. spawn eggs. The sign says sheep, not eggs. Might as well throw it and give it a shot. It's gonna spawn a sheep. A sheep? Is is that a monster? That is not so bad. It is fluffy. The eggs all have creatures inside them. And they're all different colors. They must be, you know, color-coded what's in them. So, she can just spawn things whenever she wants to. So, the Eversource makes these spawn egg things. Stay on your toes! We're close! Ah, I can't wait! <laughs> <laughs> Let's take a look around. All right. Uh, pigs, sheep, slime. I think it's the pigment that's zombies. Is that a little chicken? What is that? Hey there, little guy. King chicken. Incredible. The Eversource is a chicken. What? Yes. The spawn eggs. It's so simple. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. That's the Eversource? So the chicken lays the eggs, and the eggs make monsters, and the loot from the monsters made this place. Well, throw it in the minecart, and let's get out of here. We're still taking it, right? The chicken that the entire city depends on? Are you sure that's a good idea? What are you talking about? We need to bring it to the people. With it, we'll finally be free of the Founder! But that clucking thing is what we came for! I'm just gonna stay quiet. <gasps> what? Ah. Uh. I knew it! I knew you were here to steal from me! Ah! Uh. Pain! Oh, she's too fast! Just give me a second to catch my breath. Hey, get your... Says the trespassing what? criminal. It's just like I told you, Founder. They're here to steal the Eversource. Classic Order of the Stone. You don't say. What? No! Don't believe that! Oh, Aiden, will you just shut up already? You just expect me to believe a bunch of criminals? Aiden warned me that you were a pack of thieves, and here you are, prepared to make off with the one thing our city depends on to survive. Boy, when you put it like that, I almost feel bad. Yep, afraid I'm going to be taking the chicken. It's mine now. What? This is outrageous. Aiden, don't do this. Somebody order eggs. Oh! Creeper, look out! Save her! Save her! Bye, bye, sheep. I've got Aiden. Save the fountain. You got me, Lucas. Sure, save her. Thank you, thank you, Lucas. Lucas. <gasps> you damn son of a bitch. Ah! I'll take it from here. <laughs> Not that scared her. Thanks to you, we get to see what really happens when you fall off the islands. Hey, you can't pin this on me. This is your fault. Are you serious? Yeah. I'm serious. Trusting the blaze rods, hiding the Eversource, I didn't do any of that. Hmm, I can't decide whether I want our death to be painless for my sake or excruciating for yours. Land! Impossible. That's impossible! Jesse? There! Can we get to it in time? It's gonna be close! 
Come on. Just don't hit the lava. Don't hit the lava. Don't hit the fucking lava. Alright, yeah, we can make it. Look at that. Easy. Is that the sh that's a sheep. That's a sheep right there. <laughs> Where's Lucas? Jesse? There he is. Holy crap, you're down here too? Lucas, you made it. Oh, yeah, only slightly worse for wear. Ah, gotta say, Aiden's tougher than I remember. Mm. Got me pretty good. I'm just so glad you're okay. When Aiden pitched you over the side, that was awful. Yeah, I wasn't a huge fan either. <laughs> ah. That was good of you to try and save the founder. Uh, speaking of whom, is she okay? She's just sort of staring. Uh, let me ask. Founder? Miss Founder? I, uh, hope she's not in shock or something. You, uh, doing okay over there? I just, I... I can't believe it. <sighs> this has been down here the whole time. I forbade anyone to look for land below us. It was too dangerous. A, a lost cause. Well, land is gonna be a pretty big game changer for you guys. I mean, it's gonna change everything. Yes. Look at this place. Totally untouched biomes all around us. Yes, it's all a little overwhelming. What, what do I do now? Well, how about you start with a few deep breaths? <laughs> First things first, we're gonna go back up there and kick Aiden's butt. Sounds like the start of a winning plan to me. Getting back up. My word, you're right. We need to do that. I hadn't even thought that far ahead yet. Oh shit. I had to meet myself very quick. What's going on up there? They're dropping oh, monsters. That's not a good sign. Aiden's made some big mistakes. Probably in completely over his head by now. I can't believe Aiden could be so stupid. I can't leave my friends in whatever trouble they're in. Jesse, will you please help me get back to Sky City? Stop Aiden. Help me protect my Yes. Angel. Of course I'll help. I don't have an option. Founder. Thank you, Jesse. And please call me Isa. Isa. Okay, getting back. Up. Getting back up. Let's see what we've got to work with. Water and lava. Hmm, that'll work. And trees. What is it? Ah, oh, I see where you're getting at. Nice. Get ready to build something huge. Maybe the biggest thing of your life. What do you mean? We're gonna build a tower of dirt all the way back up to Sky City. Grab as much all dirt right. as you can carry. How much is it? Is he seriously not gonna fucking? Uh, okay, that should do it. Jesse, what is that? Lucas. Oh my! We don't have the flint and steel. It's the other half of the portal that brought me here. Man, what a relief! I mean, once you get that flint and steel back, it should be a straight shot home now. Well, guys, you ready? Yes, I I think so. I, uh, All right. I think I actually got to sit this one out, Jesse. It got me pretty good. I'm just not sure I'm up for towering all the way back up there. All right, all I'm right. Sorry. Oh shit. I probably wouldn't be able to keep I thought... up anyway. What? But it's dangerous alone. It's monsters, nightfall. I'll get some food, put together a shelter if it gets dark. It's not my first rodeo. All right. I didn't mean to uh I thought he was just going to start building. I didn't. <laughs> All right. There you go, buddy. Thank you for trying to help. It was very noble. Hey, what's with the last goodbye tone? I'll see you guys when you get back. Oh, and give Aiden another punch for me. Badly. Come on, we've got an epic climb ahead of us. All right, Isa. We've got a city to save. You ready? I believe so. And when I get up there, I'm going to tear those blaze rods limb from limb. 
damn right. Oh, I'm Jesse. I appreciate what you did up there. Trying to save me, I mean. Alright, let's just start building. <laughs> oh my god, they're looking straight ahead. That's the most terrifying thing I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. No, we need to get in there now. Go, 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 don't stop. Now we're gonna have to dodge. Whoa, that was crazy. You okay? <gasps> what have they done? Do they not have weapons? What kind of fucking guards are these? What is going on here? The city is under attack by monsters, ma'am. Everywhere. They seem to be coming from inside the palace itself. Come on, we need to stop him. I'm sorry, Jesse, but I have to save my people. All right, fair. That's fair. Out there, okay? And to you as well. Yes, you're alive. Please, can oh. you help us? Hang tight, Milo. We just whoop their ass. Yeah. Bye bye. Bye bye. Oh hell no! Get the spider. Get the spider. Oh my god, you just beat it to death. Very quick on your feet. But with all seriousness, how are you alive? I saw you go over the edge. Hey, quick version. You know how you all thought there was nothing but void below you? Yes. Yeah, that was wrong. There's land. You speak truthfully, my friend? No. I'm back here, dickhead. Well, I can't wait to hear all about it later. I gotta get to the palace. Thank you, my friend. We'll see you on the other side. <laughs> Petra. Petra, whoop it, whoop it. Oh, oh. oh hell no. Ivor. Aiden has taken over the palace. He's holed up in the throne room, throwing those spawn eggs everywhere. No one could get inside. We need to stop him. I know. Jesse, take one of these. They're all locally sourced and handcrafted. I use invisibility. Only the best ingredients. Got any potions of invisibility? Here. Can I not take speed as well? That. <laughs> Stop what you can't see. Go. Fuck you. Back down and get <laughs> out of my face, Reggie. You're delusional, Aiden. The people of Sky City will never bow to you! You killed the Founder! Yeah? Well, you're gonna be next if you... Aiden, you've lost! I saw you fall! You went down! You're alive! You're alive! I'm alive! Is the Founder with you? Uh-oh. What the... Reginald! Reggie! Not one more step! I killed you once! I could do it again! You thought you could just kick me off the edge? Unfortunately for you, Aiden, I'm pretty tough to kill. Just die already! Oh, shit for me, Timbo's life. Shut up left while you had the chance! Hey, I do not. Go away. Die. Oh ho! You ain't stopping me. Uh huh. Why couldn't you have left well enough alone? <laughs> Kill him. Yeah, smile while you do it. 
Wow, what a bitch. What a bitch. Oh god. Haha. <laughs> I'm coming to whoop your ass, Aiden. You are not going anywhere. <laughs> See someone else succeed, doesn't it? Aiden, this isn't about who wins and who loses. It's about what's right, and that is why you're gonna lose. <laughs> yeah, come on, do it. I'll whoop you. Okay. Strike him down. Come on, Jesse. Strike him. There's nothing he can do. <laughs> His sword is gone. No more sword for you. Wait, wait, wait! Hang on. <laughs> Hang on. I, I, I surrender. I surrender. Please Such a bitch. Right? Here! Here! You want your flint and steel back, huh? Take it! It's yours! Just, please, don't hurt me! I'll take it, gladly. You did it! Jesse, we need to get out of here! What do you want to do with him? Please! This place is getting worse by the minute! Oh, now you realize it. Take me here! Take me with you! For everything you've done, I'm not sure you deserve that kind of mercy. Oh, no, 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 no. come on! I have to, Ooh, I have to send him over. Whew. What? Aha! <laughs> I think he's gonna survive. I wish I didn't want, but. I would have walked away, honestly, if I didn't have that option. Would have left him. Oh my god. Jesse! <laughs> we heard the fighting. He tried to fight me. He didn't win. Damn. You retrieved the ever source. Yes, ma'am. Everyone, stay together. Jesse, there you are. Jesse, the situation is getting out of hand. We simply can't stop all the monsters. Then we jump. My people. The longer we stay here, the more danger my people will be in. I guess we could jump for it. The waterfalls. The waterfalls can take us to safety. What? Uh huh. Are you crazy? The waterfalls will just take us into the void. We'll die if we fall down there. But there's nothing but monsters up here. The void won't kill you. There's land down there. Everyone just watch me and follow my lead, okay? Let's go. Why is why is no one jumping? Why is no one jumping? Jesse has done nothing but help us so far. I will show you just how much I believe in Jesse's word. I'm surprised she wasn't the first one to jump in afterwards.
I'll get to land as quick as possible in case people try to land on top of you. You are alive. There's ground everywhere. Jesse, I cannot thank you enough. You've saved us all. So what do we do now? Everything's just so different and scary. What do you do? You go have fun. You guys were cooped up there so long, now you can go do whatever you want. I wonder what happened to Aiden. Hey, guards. Check out what washed up right next to me. Uh, <laughs> criminals, you're not going anywhere. Now, this is just speculation, but I'm guessing they have some regrets. Knew they, wouldn't they deserve it. <laughs> what goes around comes around, am I right, guys? Deserved. Don't give me that look. <laughs> Attention! Attention! Hello, hello, everyone, please. This is your founder speaking. Now that we're all safe, we need to organize. Start planning our new community. Are you listening to yourself? That's insane! We were prisoners long enough on that island in the sky. It is time for us to run free. Build whatever we please. Wow. Those two just cannot get along. Jesse, I cannot allow my people to be influenced by this naive idealist. Bah! I'm sure I do look like a naive idealist through the eyes of an oppressive dictator. Just relax a minute, okay? Relax? Relax? My people are in more danger than they ever have been, and you want me to relax! No, you don't understand. It will be night soon, and that is when the monsters come out. If we don't prepare, we'll be in danger. You're just making excuses to control our behavior, just like before. We must trust in ourselves, be able to learn from our mistakes. The people need to build! W what do we do? Who are we supposed to listen to? Well, I think you're both right. You don't want to just run around with no plan, but you can't schedule and organize everything either. People need to be free to try new things, but you've got to be safe about it. I suppose I still have much to learn. Thank you, Jesse. I don't understand yet, but I trust you. Well, Jesse, I suppose the era of Sky City is over. We may disagree about how to run this place, but I thank you for everything you have done. I guarantee that we will be telling stories about your visit for many, many years to come. This is a second chance at making a civilization. Don't waste it, okay? I don't intend to. I give my solemn oath. You know something? She was a little scary at first, but... She's alright. <laughs> I'm gonna miss that crazy guy. I guess we should prepare for Nightfall too. Without another portal, we're stuck here. It's been a while since I've had to start from square one. Ugh. Just when I thought my days of punching trees were behind me. That would be the case, but luckily you had me as your advanced scout. When I was on the ground with the founder before I totally found the portal. And you didn't say anything? Yeah. I'm actually gonna have to agree with Ivor on this one. Did I not mention it either? Cause I could have sworn I said something. No! You didn't! I guess the moment just never presented itself. Come on. Oh, hi. Ah, oh, there you are. I'm so sorry about her. That's okay. Looks like she's having fun running around. Yes, I think she took it pretty well when I told her she didn't need to be the Eversource anymore. What are we gonna do with you now, huh? What are you going to do now? Besides continue to be adorable, of course. <laughs> but that was a given. Now that you don't have to run everything yourself, maybe you could use the time to travel. There's a lot to see. Yes, that's a rather nice notion. How would you like to go explore some of those, um, very tall vertical rocks? <laughs> we call them mountains, usually. Lovely. After so long being the founder and the Eversource, now we can just be Isa and her best friend, Benedict. Ah! That's a boy's name. Huh, what a closed-minded attitude. <laughs> Jesse, I would be honored if you would take this as a small token of our gratitude. Thank you. Come along, Benedict. 
We have a lot of adventures ahead of us. Well, there goes the Eversaurs. Off to cluck and peck at seeds for the rest of its valuable life. Hey, Jesse. You okay? Jesse? Yeah, I'm fine. Come on, let's head home. Okay. See? Just like I told you, one portal back home. Well, we don't know if it goes there. But game logic, it probably does. I just can't wait to put this whole world behind us. Oh, is someone being grumpy? No! A little. I was just hoping for a real treasure is all. <laughs> Life stars, we have a, no proper we have a, treasure. Uh, uh, Although I wonder crown. what would happen if you put that tiny crown on a different chicken. Come on, guys. Let's go home. Alright, let's light it. There's no way this takes us home. But like I said, game logic. We don't Axel and Olivia here when we've been. They'll never believe it. Okay. That's not what I was expecting. Oh yeah. That leads up to episode six. Yeah, um, that's with all the Minecraft YouTubers, with Dan, TDM, Stampy, and them lot. I completely forgot about that. Um, so, all right, you and thirty-five point point four percent of players demolished Ivor's house. You and forty-nine point nine percent of players ran from the guards. You and eighty point four percent of players tried to rescue. Isa and you and 65.7% of players made Isa and Milo share power. Alright, and that's the game since I do not own episode 6 to 8. Alright, yeah, very fun game. Very fun game.